So I'm just thinking out loud about something I find interesting. And what it is is um that men and women are different. They have different abilities and different aspirations, different techniques for doing stuff, different ideas, and so different capabilities all around in so many aspects. So I've just been looking at YouTube of um, the Arecibo radio telescope, some giant dish in a forest somewhere, reading signals from the universe. And it made me think that I know that men built that radio telescope. Men installed it, they found all the materials to make it. They did all the cabling and wiring and set up of the system so that we can monitor signals from space and look at things far away. So the telescope with like a big dish is entirely man-made, man-constructed. And I imagine only men are operating the telescope as well. And this, this is just one example of the, the things that men do in the world. I mean, I could talk all day about the things around us that, that we depend on, our houses, our roads and streets, um, our lights, our electricity, our water supply into our houses, um, our cars, our computers, everything pretty much of any importance in our world is man-made, man-constructed, man-maintained. Men do this work. Men make our world work brilliantly. And they're very inventive, very hardworking, very conscientious. And the reason I'm making this statement is that um, I don't think it's appreciated correctly or fully how we are so dependent on the efforts of men, on the genius of men. And I think it should be appreciated and um, I don't know why it's important to me. I've always found the differences between men and women to be interesting and I've explored this a lot in the man-woman myth documentaries which are on this channel and elsewhere on YouTube as well. I'm just pointing out the efforts of men in making a world possible. When you turn the tap at home, water flows because of the work of men. And when you watch television, the reason you have pictures on the screen, the reason you have electrical power running to the television, the reason you have the television in itself is because of the work of men. Virtually alone, I would say. Men and women are different. They have different abilities and they make different contributions to how the world works. Men are, are, are pretty much exceptional in how capable they are in doing all manner of things. And as I say, men are different to women, and women women are simply not able to do the same things that men do. It's just the way it is. And I'm recognizing this and giving credit where it's due to the work of men to make my life possible. I know that the reason there's food in the fridge is primarily because of the work of men. The reason that I have a fridge at all is because of men. The reason there is that electricity to power the fridge is because of the work of men. The reason I have a kitchen in a house is because of the work of men. I could go on, but there's a lot of things we have in our lives that is exclusively provided by the work of men. I don't see a problem in pointing this out. And that's why I'm doing it.